In this video we will learn what's new in the new version of Tesla SCADA 220. The main feature we added in this version is video processing. To add video in your project, choose widgets collections and choose video object in this collection. In the L, add L from the web, for example, in our case. Choose video type. This video type MJPEG. And click OK. You can test your video in Tesla SCADA 2 ID, not only in Tesla SCADA runtime. Let's extend this video. Now we test some features of this video object. Motion detect is possible use only on desktop version of our product in Windows, MacOS or Linux versions. To use motion detect we should create tag. Let's name it motion detect and choose data type double and click OK. Choose the data tag in motion detect. This time interval shows us the time interval between two frames that will be compared. Let's show the value of this tag by using one of the our objects, for example, text object. And let's see. This value is percentage between two frames. Shows the difference between two frames of the video. You can use this value for some purposes, for example, for alarms. If, for example, this value will be more than 5, you can Alarm with this message. Let's see how it works. And for example, you can use this value to after save images. For example, if this value higher than five, more than five, the image from this video will be saved. Okay. Let's see. The video will be saved in the folder where, where a project is created and save, save in the folder with the name of this video camera object. The name of our video camera object video 0 and the name of the folder video 0. You can watch images saved by clicking on it in on your disk. Also, the all the 
events happened. You can watch by using events table. All alarms are detected. You can watch by using table, events table. And value of motion detect. There are also other several, several types of video you can watch by using this object. For example, you can watch video with video stream MP, MPA4 XM file V which less. For example, video like this one. And video with type JPEG. For example, this one. If you want to restrict access to the video content, you can use, for example, new screen. For example, we, we use pop up video type, screen type. Change name and add new video object. Choose this web URL and choose data type video type MGPEG. Now in our main screen, choose button label video and choose control call pop up and choose our video screen. We forgot to use password. Now let's check. Now to watch this with the content for, from this video camera, you should know the password. And now you can watch. Okay. Also, in our new version, we add new new scripts. object like logarithm and natural logarithm. In this example we will use only one logarithm. To test it we create two three tags, new tags. For example, base value and Okay. 
also float that type. Now let's edit base to the input to value to the input one and name to the output. If base we will change to and value to, we will get logarithm one. If base to value four, then to base to value eight, logarithm three. That's all.